good day everyone so for today's video uh, we're going to tackle about half angle identities uh, specifically tangent okay <clears throat> so let's start so in finding the half identities of a tangent we're going to use the formula tan a over 2 or we can uh, replace it as a theta or a uh, it's up to you, okay? It's up to you. Uh, a over 2 equals 1 minus cosine A over sine A. So, if you ask by your teacher to find the half identities of that specific tangent, so you are going to use this uh, formula, okay? So, for example, okay? So, for example, use a half angle identity to find tan 75 degrees, okay? So, we have... Okay, so we have this formula. So, A, A over 2 equals 1 minus cos A over sine A. So, first, we're going to find the value of A. So, A over 2 equals, so we have 75 here, right? We have 75, the given 75. So, A over 2 equals 75. And uh, we're going to find the A. So, we're going to cross multiply. So, 75 times 2. So, we have 150, right? So, we have the value of A of 150. So, the purpose of getting the value of A so that we, uh, in the cosine A and sine A, uh, we can put a value, okay? That is the purpose in finding the A. So, now we have the value of A which is 150 degrees. So, the next step is, uh, wait. So, we're going to copy. So, uh, so, tan 75 degrees equals 1 minus cos 150 degrees. So, where did we get, add, did we get, get the 150? So, the A over 2 equals 75 and we multiply 75 by 2, right? So, cos 150 and sine 150. And then, here, 8. Oh. So, then, just uh, now go in the process. So, the value of cos 150 degrees. So, we have you uh, just look to uh, no, some table. You can find the value of cos 150. So, the value of cos 150 or you can solve it directly. So, the value is the value is negative square root of 3 over 2. And the value of sine 150 is 1 half. Okay? And then, the next step, you're going to distribute the negative sign. Uh, the negative sign, this one here. So, so then, then the and the next process. So we have one plus square root of three over two, all over one half. Okay, and then after that, after having that proportion, okay. So you are going to simplify. Okay, you are going to simplify. So. In that portion, you're going to multiply both sides or both numerator and denominator by 2 because you have 1 half. And based in the, in the rule, you're going to find the reciprocal of 2 uh, or uh, the 1 half rather. So you have 2 and you're going to multiply it in the denominator and in the numerator. Okay? So, now, so... So, in this portion, so just like we have 2 here and we have 2 here. And if you multiply 1 half by 2, so automatic you have 1 in the denominator. And then, 2, and you're going to multiply by 2 times 1 plus root of 3 over 2. Okay? So, you have a, ah no, so you have a 2 plus square root of 3. Okay? 2 square root of 3. So, why we have square root of 3? Because you're going to cancel also. Because square root of, uh, square root of 3 over 2 times 2, you're going to cancel the 2. So, the remaining would be square root of 3. So, 2 plus square root of 3 all over 1. So, we have the final answer. So, in finding the half identities of tan 75 degrees, so we have 2 plus square root of 3. So, 
uh, in that way we can get the value of a half identities of a tangent just follow the formula and just simplify and just simplify and you can get the final answer by the use of the formula which is 1 minus cos a all over sine a so thank you